Look, you've got three cats. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so round two, this is going to be the jacket over the uh, cot. Hi everyone, really excited. We've got the waterproof jacket pre-production samples through. So these have been about a year in the development um, and now we're ready to get making and hoping that these are going to be ready to come out in the autumn. So thought we'd do a little run through just to show you um, what they're like. So this is Al. Um, Al is about six foot two, he's 44 and a half inch chest and he's got the XL on um, and we're just going to run through a few of the features. So the fabric, um, the waterproof rating and the breathability rating is uh, 15,000 so really good ratings for both of those. Um, on the front you've got nice silicone strips and those are to stop your race vest from slipping when you've got them over the top. Um, also, to make them nice and breathable, we've got, first of all, zips under the arms, pit zips, so that you can open them up and get a little bit of um, air going through. And then, Al, if you could just open up the front, the big zip, sorry. So underneath the big zip, we've also got a little press stud. So say if you're running and you just want to let a little bit of air in, but not have everything flapping around, then you can just do up the press stud and then just allow a little bit of air to come through as well. Fab, thank you. Okay, you've also got on the sleeves, you've got nice thumb holes. So that can keep your hands nice and dry and they're nice and long so you can really get your hands covered when the, uh, when the weather's pretty bad. Got reflective logos as well. And then we've got three pockets on the front. So we've got a little one on the top left some people will be able to fit the phone in there if it's not got a big case on and then we've also got two um, either side at the front as well that have just got some grippy zippers on nice and then if you turn around we'll just show you the pocket on the back as well so if you've got maybe a map um, or you go out without a ba uh, bag on then you can also put your phone or anything else or gels that you need for access in um, in the back pocket okay fab so if you turn around again now Al so we're going to try it with the race vest over the top so you can see what it looks like. So this is our Kinder 10 litre. And so the silicone grippers will just stop it from sliding around too much. Very nice. And then if you give us a little twirl, so you can see the all of the pockets are still nice and accessible. So it just gives you lots of extra storage options where you need lots of pockets uh, for everywhere. And then the hood, so most important part on the jacket. So we worked a lot on the hood and um, making sure that it was a really good shape. The peak comes all the way around your face, so it's going to protect you from the rain and the wind. You've also got three different size adjusters, one at each side. And you've also got one at the back. That's it. If you turn around slightly out, so you've got that one at the back as well. So when you're turning your head, your head isn't just moving in the hood and it's going to move with your head and it's not all irritating and flapping around your face okay fantastic right so that is the demo with the jacket on and now we're going to show you the jacket um over the race vest so one of the things that thought was really important is that when you run in and it's going to be warm and it's going to be raining you're not always going to be wanting to take your vest off to have to put your jacket on so we wanted to make sure the jacket fit really well over the race vest so if you pop that on Al what we've done on the back of the vest is we've just put in a few really discreet pleats so that when you put it on over a race vest if you turn around now Al I'll show it while she's zipping it up you can see that it fits really nicely over the back so when you do it up over your vest it isn't being pulled really tight on the front um, when you've got it on um, underneath your pack or wearing it on its own you can't really notice at all so that's how it fits and if you turn around now Al, as you can see on the front it still looks like a really nice shape so it's going to be really comfortable we've also got these uh, double zips on the front so if you undo your little one which makes it really easy access to things like your soft flasks. If you want to take a drink whilst you're running, you've not got the central zip, which makes it quite difficult to access things. Fab. 
And then the last little feature that we thought would work really well um, is a bum bag feature. So say if you're running now, it stopped raining, you're starting to get really hot again, you can take the whole jacket off. Just a second. <laughs> you can take the whole jacket off and then I'll just show a little close up of these press studs now before you roll it up. So on each side of the jacket, you've got a double set of these press studs here. So all you need to do is um, roll it up. If you fold the sleeves in, it stops them flapping out. And then you can just roll it up. Should be quite quick to do if you don't want to have to stuff it back in your vest again because it might start raining again soon. And then you'd wrap it around your waist, do up the press studs, and then you can just start running again. So if you're doing things like fell running, um, or if you've got a day that's particularly showery, you know, on and off, then you don't have to keep taking it in and outside of your bag. Fab. And then if you turn around, then what you can do is, um, if you have this back pocket out a little bit, you can actually make the back pocket still um, accessible whilst you've got it as a bit of a bum bag feature. So there you go. Thanks very much. Um, I hope you've liked seeing it. We're gonna have more details about this soon. Still waiting for an exact date of when they're gonna be available, but I'm hoping that it's gonna be October. We are gonna have pre-sales on these so we can get them ready for Christmas as well. Um, so we'll bring out more information as soon as we've got it available. Oh, and the price point is gonna be 89 pounds. Thanks a lot.